This is the U uh sound, as in the words wood, look, and good. It's a vowel sound, and its technical name is the near close, near back vowel. Remember that the key to pronunciation is physical, and the name tells us about how the sound is made physically. In this case, your tongue is close to the top and near the back of your mouth. All vowels are made through the mouth and are voiced, which means that you'll need to vibrate your vocal cords to make the sound. This sound is similar to the oo sound, but it's shorter. Oo, not oo. To produce the sound, put your tongue close to the top and near the back of your, of your mouth. Then make a short voiced sound with your mouth closed. Ooh. 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 The uh sound is normally spelled with the letter U, as in the words education and put. But it can also be spelled with the letter O or double O, as in the words woman and book. Like with all vowels in English, the spelling can be very inconsistent, and you'll always find alternative and unusual spellings of the vowel sounds. It's one of the most difficult things in English, but you just have to learn it. Words don't normally start with this sound, but here are some words that have the uh sound in the middle. Foot, full, pull, and push. Not many words end with this symbol either. There are a couple of examples, but when we say them by themselves, we normally use the longer oo, like uh, into and onto. But when they're in a sentence, they can be pronounced with the oo sound. For example, put your violin into the case and my coat fell onto the floor. So that's it for the uh sound, but we've made additional videos on each of the groups of sounds, vowels, diphthongs, single consonants and consonant pairs, as well as video, a video explaining the overall phonetic charts. You can also click on any of the symbols behind me to see a similar video with lots of examples and an explanation about how to pronounce that sound. We regularly post new videos, so if you like this video and want to continue improving your English, please click here to subscribe to our channel. At the English Club, we also offer live English classes via Skype or Google Hangouts. Visit our website to make a booking with me or one of our other teachers. You can also follow us on Twitter and Facebook.